Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a little video um, with Space Odyssey, a new green and Hocus Pocus from the Glitter Acrylic range from the Halloween box sets. So I'm just blending down um, as yet an unreleased green. I'm still deciding what I'm doing with it so yeah and this is Hocus Pocus it's a pre-mixed glitter acrylic and as you've seen it's pretty um, yeah so I've I've just blended that up and I'm just making sure it's where I want it I'm going to do a full finger now of Space Odyssey so I've picked up a really large bead um, and I'm just pulling it down now I did bring two I did pick up too much so I just take off what I don't need I then press in some little stars I don't even remember where I got them from but they're little silver ones and they're really cute so I, I just press them in and please ignore my thumb. I lost an argument with a backpack and I have been working non-stop and have not had a chance to repair it yet. And so, yeah, I've just popped them in. The middle finger, I'm doing a marble. So I'm coming in, as always, with my cuticle bead um, just to make sure I've got a lovely flush cuticle. And then I'm blending in the green and virgin white. I then dot in some Space Odyssey and little bits of the glitter with the glitter acrylic mix. I didn't, because I just wanted to dot it in, I didn't pick up a uh, any monomer. I literally just touched the brush to the acrylic and dabbed it on because I just wanted a sprinkling of it and there'd be enough liquid in my brush and on the nail to absorb any acrylic pigments. Um, this finger was just a nightmare. I think I put the wrong tip in, the wrong size. Um, so it didn't fit very well and during the capping process, oh, cheeky little discount card there guys. During the capping process, it wouldn't stay still, so I had to end up taking it out to finish capping it. Obviously, with a real person, that would not happen. Or if it does, scream and run, guys, scream and run. <laughs> yes, so. <coughs> the thumb I did an ombre from Space Odyssey down with the green coming up and then I I didn't m marble it but I did dot a bit of acrylic glitter across just to give it a little bit of sparkle <laughs> more than the Space Odyssey yeah I know I like sparkles I like to work quite wet with my ombre beads. <laughs> yeah, sorry. My dear husband trying to distract me. Um, yeah, so this is just me dotting my bits of acrylic glitter across. I did actually pick up a bead for that. It's all right. Um, sorry, my little ones. Um, and yes, I now cap pretty much the same way I always do. I always start to make sure my cuticle is nice. And like I said, I messed up the... Yeah, I'll charge it in a minute. Sorry. <laughs> um, I, I messed up the index finger purely because I don't think I had the right tip size in. When you're capping it is always easier to do most of the work with your brush than with your hand file. So 
I like to I like to work it a little bit. My application, yeah, might take me a little longer than some, but at least then sometimes when I'm filing in the salon, I will just when especially when I'm infilling, I will infill so smooth that I literally just go over with a white block and I'm ready for polish. So application is definitely key in these points. Obviously with the capping I would put my strength and my apex in but seeing as these are tips I'm not focusing too much <coughs> sorry, on strength. This is the dodgy finger that drove me crazy. I definitely think I've picked up the wrong tip. Do you see how it's sliding out? Yeah, that shouldn't... A, a real person wouldn't do that. Like I say, if they do, run. Run very far and very fast. Yeah, so I, I still wanted to show you guys me tip... Me doing it, so... I just took it out and ignore my scary thumb. Obviously because that's got wet acrylic on, I try not to touch wet acrylic overexposure and all that so I'm literally just going to cap my thumb then I will file and I will show you guys me top coating it is always always my favorite part of every every set of nails I've tried something a little different with the top coat in part as I wanted to show each individual nail the, the serious wow factor. Obviously I do polish a lot neater when it's a person. <laughs> I'm, I'm just... yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys and don't forget to check us out on Facebook, Instagram and give us a thumbs up if you like it. Okay, bye.